Wubo is very excited. Wubo has been invited to a sleepover at Wubo's friend Lily's house. They are going to make dinner, watch movies, and stay up late. It's going to be so much fun. Yay! Wubo has packed jammies, a toothbrush, and clothes for tomorrow. And I have my extra cozy Wubo sleeping bag. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. Wubo is at Lily's house now, and it's time for the sleepover to begin. Wubo, I'm so excited you came over for a sleepover. I asked my dad to cook my favorite meal, lobster macaroni and cheese. What little lobster? Says Wubo. I've never had lobster before. I don't think I like it. Oh no. Wubo thinks. <gasps> yes, it's my favorite food. And macaroni and cheese is my favoriteest. And together, they're my favoriteest, favoriteest, favoriteest squared. Oh. The lobster looks kind of weird. Are you sure? Asks Wubo, looking worried. <laughs> Lobsters do look kind of weird. But you don't see their shells in macaroni and cheese. Silly, that's my favoriteest food. Don't yuck my yum. She isn't smiling, and her eyebrows are lowered. How do you think Lily feels right now? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were in her place? Hmm. Do you think she feels hurt, curious, or shy? Yes, it looks like Lily's feelings were hurt. Wubo said something mean about her favorite food. Wubo didn't mean to hurt Lily's feelings. Wubo thinks it's time for an apology. Wubo says, I'm sorry, Lily. I didn't mean to insult your favorite food. Thanks for apologizing, Wubo. Lily gives Wubo a big hug. Wubo and Lily have a fun time playing until dinner, but Wubo is nervous about eating the lobster mac and cheese. As it gets closer to dinner, Wubo hears noises coming from the kitchen. Pots are clinking and water is boiling. What? Are you kidding me? Wubo starts to really worry about dinner. Wubo thinks, What will the lobster mac and cheese look like? Wubo's imagination runs wild. Weird! What in the world? Wubo starts to think about what might happen at dinner. Lily's dad will say, Let me have your plate, Wubo, and I'll serve you some mac and cheese. I'm not eating that stuff. Wubo will yell. Lily's dad will frown. That's not very polite, Wubo. Wubo will say, Okay, okay. Lily's dad will serve Wubo. And Wubo will take a bite. Yeah. This is so gross. I can't eat that. Make me something different. Wubo will cry. Lily will look sad again. Wubo, you said you wouldn't insult my favoriteest food. Wubo, in this house we use our manners at the dinner <laughs> table. Now I think you owe some apologies. How do you think Wubo would feel? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were Wubo? Hmm. How do you think Lily would feel if Wubo did this at the dinner table? What makes you think that? How would you feel in Lily's place? Hmm. How do you think Lily's dad would feel? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were Lily's dad? Hmm. Oh, good. It isn't dinner time yet. Wubo thinks... Acting like that would be really bad. Wubo doesn't know what to do. For dessert, we are going to have ice cream sundaes. We can add whatever toppings we want. But there aren't any nuts because I'm allergic. Just then, Wubo and Lily hear... Lily, Wubo, it's dinner time. 
Rudy and Hubo go into the kitchen and sit down. Oh, Hubo. Hubo doesn't know what to do. Hubo doesn't want to hurt Lily's or her dad's feelings. Hubo is really nervous about Jenner. Help Hubo pick a strategy that is polite. Hubo can try being honest, choosing Hubo's own portion sizes, or trying a few bites before deciding. To explore what would happen. Lily's dad serves everyone their dinner. Wubo looks at the lobster mac and cheese, still a little nervous. Wubo thinks, I will try one bite for each year old I am. And maybe I can eat the mac and cheese and not the lobster if I don't like the lobster. Wubo feels pretty good about this strategy and takes a bite. Wubo hopes to like the mac and cheese since it's Lily's favorite. Do you think Wubo likes the lobster mac and cheese dish? Say yes or no. Yes. Yummy. Hey, lobster is really good. Wubo really likes the mac and cheese. Thank you for cooking dinner for me, says Wubo. Wubo ate all the lobster mac and cheese on my plate. Can Wubo please have some more? After dinner, Wubo and Lily make their ice cream sundaes. I love sundaes. I guess no nuts means you don't have my favorite flavor blueberry peanut butter bologna ice cream, says Wubo. Lily says, No, I can't have blueberry peanut butter bologna ice cream. I think my dad bought vanilla and chocolate. That's okay. I really like vanilla and chocolate too, says Wubo. I feel so silly making such a big deal about the lobster. It was really yummy. Lily smiles. That's okay. Thank you. The important part is, you tried it. Wubo has thought about some good strategies for eating dinner. Maybe Wubo can come back later and try the other strategies too. How do you think Lily feels about how Wubo handled the situation? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were Lily? How do you think Lily's dad feels about how Wubo handled the situation? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were Lily's dad? How do you think Wubo feels about how Wubo handled the situation? What makes you think that? How would you feel if you were Wubo? Wubo feels pretty good about the situation. After dessert, Wubo and Lily are going to play Space Cowboys versus Wizards. Wubo hopes to have another sleepover with Lily soon. 